Good morning. Hey everybody. Uh, my, my beautiful sunburn and I wanted to jump on here this morning to share a little message with you about how how I'm kind of processing all that's going on around the world and um, just a message with you about how I would encourage you to move forward because I think you know I'm not in Canada right now I'm I'm in Mexico and there is definitely not the same panic here as I'm watching unfold on social media and with you know communication with my friends and family who are in Canada uh, and the US um, so you know, I, I can appreciate everything that's going on and uh, the, the panic that you might be feeling and the fear that you might be feeling and appreciating that that is normal to feel that way. However, we have a choice. We have a choice in a situation like this to see it with fear or to maintain our faith and our trust and see it with love. We are all still the same human beings on this earth. We are all still connected. We all still need to show respect and love for one another. But when we're being led with fear, it becomes very hard to see what's in front of us. The, the lens of fear, if, you're, if you have a viewpoint where you are just being guided by fear, it will derail you from what you want in your life. It will derail your relationships, it will derail your ability to cope, and you will see things with fear. And when we are overwhelmed with that kind of thinking and feeling, that's what we're gonna project into this world. And right now, with you know, when I think back to 2011, I think it was when we had the SARS outbreak, social media was not what it is today. And with the way that our social media is now, it is compounding the fear exponentially. So what I'm encouraging you to do is to fill your feed with love. Stop posting all the fear. The, the less energy we feed this fear, the less energy it has over us. You are not powerless in a situation like this. You have control over yourself. You have the power to choose how you respond in a situation like this. In a time of darkness, be the light and shine the way for others.